a couple things about law enforcement. It's I don't think that's how Jack Smith is looking at this in terms of will it deter people um, from doing this? Um, will it uh, change votes? Will it lead to certain people waking up to what happened? I think this is entirely about the fact that there have been scores of people who have been charged who are much lower level than the former president for the for crimes that are less serious yeah. than this. They have obstructed, but they were, as, as the January 6th committee described them, foot soldiers to what's charged here, which is the leader of that conspiracy. And I think that's the way um, Jack Smith looks at it. I have to say this is a bad day for lawyers. When you look yeah, at is. this, um, conspirator one is Rudy Giuliani. Um, conspirator two is clearly John Eastman. Conspirator three is Sidney Powell. Conspirator four is Jeff Clark. Conspirator five appears to be Ches Kevin Chesbro. Mm -hmm. Conspirator six, not sure um, who that is. It's the one political consult consultant and non-lawyer. And let me both associate myself with your legal analysis and make a point. We have a NBC process for confirming these matters Absolutely. with external reporting. And so far, we've done that only with Eastman, whose attorney did confirm moments ago that he is he is co-conspirator two, and that they will they it says basically Eastman is is co-conspirator two unindicted, and they plan to send a member of the special counsel to explain why he is innocent. He has every right to make that argument.